Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss back again with another video and today we're going to take a look at the Seek Thermal Thermal Imaging Camera for your Android or iOS device. Now this is hot right here fellas. I'm getting ready to have some serious fun with this. First up, let me show you the website real quick so you can see where to get it from. Go to Amazon.com. I'll throw the link up in the description. Alright, so we got the Seek Thermal Imaging Camera, USB connector for Android devices, and like I said, it's also available for iOS devices. Now the price for this, $249. So you're looking at $250. Bucks. Pause this and read it for yourself if you want, but let's go through some of the features real quick. This thermal imaging camera for your Android smartphone detects infrared light and creates a visible image on your screen. Now in broad daylight or complete darkness, you can now detect levels of hot and cold, water leaks and more. Simply plug Seek into the USB port of your Android smartphone to generate high quality imagery. Seek captures heat signatures and converts them into easy and convenient real time picture for your smartphone device. Now this is useful for homeowners, inspectors, contractors, and more. And especially trolling your pets. Alright, that's a definite use for this. So 250 bucks for this. Let's check it out real quick. Now I went with the Android version. Okay, now it's available for iOS too. Beautiful looking presentation, 250 bucks. Now look, if you go online and look at thermal imaging cameras, they're gonna run you $700, $800. I've seen some for $1250, you know, up to two grand. So 250 bucks for this. This is a go. We're going to have to test it out first, though. Let's look at the back now, show you some good uses for this. Smart tool. All right, so now if you're using this in your house, you can find heat leaks. Okay? You can see studs in your wall. You can det uh, detect electrical shorts and water leaks. We're going to do a little live test right there, too. Also, like you see, if you got a clogged pipe, you'll be able to see exactly where the clog is at in the pipe. And I got a little pipe right here I'm going to show you. Now, for outdoors, you can use it to uh, detect wildlife. All y'all cats that go camping and fishing, hunting in the middle of the night, you can detect wildlife. You can find people in the water. All right, so when you go to the beach in the middle of the night, somebody get lost, find them in the water. And you can make sure your campfire is officially out. That's good because you don't want to leave a campfire burning. Also, uh, for situational awareness, now you can use this for security. When you park in a late night, you know, back alley somewhere, you can see people in the dark. So detect hazards in the dark, recognize your surroundings, and identify dangers. So, fellas, this might be something you want to get for your lady. All right, so let's pop this open and see what it looks like. Inside, let's see. Cooking, uh, thermography, automotive. Plenty of uses for this. Plenty of uses for this. Security, heat loss, maintenance, cooking, measurement, outdoors. Now, look at that picture right there. This is another good use for that. I, I, we'll talk about that in a minute. Let's see what you get inside. Now, here's the actual camera. Has a magnesium coating on it, so it feels like a like metal. Nice, nice build quality to it. Nice looking camera. Here's your carrying case. And let's figure out how to open this real quick. All right, a little carrying case right here. And a little key ring so you could drop, drop this right in your keys. Let's see how it fits in here. Nice little carrying case for this. All right, so I'm feeling that. Let's see, is there anything else in here? Usual books and shit. Okay, that's pretty much it. Now, it shows you right here in the front what you got to do. Download the app, attach the camera, and see the unseen. So pretty much straightforward. No instructions to really read. That's what it is. All right, so now I'm going to grab my phone. Let me pause the video real quick. I got to download the app, and i get back with y'all in a second. And we'll do a couple of uh, live tests, and we'll fool around with this camera for a minute and see how it looks in complete darkness. All right, so talk amongst yourselves. All right, now, real quick before I show you how the actual demonstration, let me show you how easy it is to set it up. All you got to do is grab your camera, find your phone's USB, plug it right in. Now, once you plug it in, it's going to open up the app. Okay, let's get let's uh, exit out of that. And here's what the app looks like. Now, let's just go through some of the uh, features of the app real quick. Let's hit the menu button. You got your help. Okay, if you need some help. You got temperature units. I got to set the Fahrenheit. Now, you have a color palette. Now, you can change the color palette. Let's go through all of the ones you have real quick. Now, let me turn this upside down so I'm not blocking the actual camera. Let's see, I got something right here. We'll just put it on display. First, we got white. Then we got black. And if you look, you see I got it set up so it shows you the actual temperature of whatever I'm uh, shooting. You got white, you got black, you got iron, you got cool, amber, indigo, Tyrian, 
which is the stock uh, default setting. And this is the uh, Predator setting. Shout out to everybody that remembers the old school Predator movies. This is what it looks like if you're looking through Predator's eyes. So the Tyrion setting. You got Glory and Envy. All right, so we're going to leave it on uh, Tyrion. Let's go back out real quick. Now, more of the menu real quick. Let's see. You got image preferences. Now, this is um <laughs> your aspect ratio. You got 16 by 9 or you got 4 by 3. You got watermarks. So you could, uh, if you want, you could put the time and date. You could put the seek branding on the bottom. Let's just click on that. Time and date, location, or seek branding. We'll turn all of those off. Uh, your metadata, that's your geotagging location and all that. Image smoothing, we'll leave that on. Let's go back out. Uh, terms and policies help us improve about basically nothing. Now, on the bottom, you can see you have camera, so you can just snap pictures, and you also have video. So you can take full videos in your thermal settings. Also, when you hit the button on the bottom, now you have four shooting modes. Okay, you got normal, which is going to shoot in regular thermal mode. You got uh, spot, which is going to show you the temperature of whatever you're shooting, the actual temperature. So let's put my hand on here real quick. You see my hand is 90 degrees. And that's can right here is 81. And I'm definitely blazing hot up in here, so that seems about right. You also got high low. So now this will show you the highest temperature and the lowest temperature on the screen. So my hand will be the highest temperature. Let's see if we can get that in there. 90, <laughs> 90, over 90, I'm burning up. And the can will be 70 something. And you also have threshold. Now what threshold does is you could set a specific range. So let's see if I hit. Let's see, anything above, let's say uh, 90. Since my hand was about 90, let's move this up to about 90. Okay? Now, anything above 90 should register on this. Let's exit out. Now, you see my hand is above 90, so everything else is going to be grayscale. Whenever something comes in the image that's above 90, it's going to be, it's going to light up. All right, so that's kind of hot. That's four different shooter modes. We'll put it back on normal. Okay, so now what I'm going to do real quick, and that's basically all the features. This is going to be a lot of fun, though. So what I'm going to do real quick, I'm going to pause the video, and um, <laughs> let me grab some hot water, some cold water. I'll grab a little pipe or something. Matter of fact, let me show you all something real quick. I was fooling around. I was looking for the cat. You see, I found the cat using the thermal imaging. So this is just a lot of fun, and it's really cheap. All right, $250 for this. So many uses for this. Now, I'm going to pause the video one more time. Let me grab a cup of hot water, a cup of cold water. We're going to turn off all the lights, and we're going to see if we can see the difference between the cold and the hot in complete darkness. All right, so get back to talking amongst yourselves. I'll be right back. All right, y'all. First demonstration. Now, I got two shot glasses on the table. One is boiling hot water, and one is ice cold water. Let's see if we can see which one is which. <laughs> now, that says it all right there. Okay, so the one on the left, this is the hot water, and this is ice cold water. Okay, so now let's go to let's let's check the temperature real quick. Okay, you see, now if y'all can look closely, on the hot water, that's 108 degrees. And on the cold water, 45 degrees. Fellas, this is so sick right here. This is so sick. Now look, we put them side by side. So you see 113 on the left and 43 degrees on the right. And just so you can see that, it's not a setup. Turn the light on real quick. This is a glass of water with some ice cubes in it, and this is just a hot cup of water. Okay, so let's look at that one more time. Side by side, hot and cold. That's kind of sick. One more demonstration for y'all. All right, I'll be right back. I gotta grab something else. All right, y'all, now here's the second test, clogged pipe. Okay, now this is a regular pipe. You see I got water in it, but it's clogged up. So say this was under your sink somewhere, uh, in the bathroom somewhere, whatever it's at. It's just a clogged pipe. You want to know where that clog is at. If this was fully connected, you wouldn't be able to see it. Now let me turn the lights off real quick, and we'll see if we can spot the clog using the camera. All right, let me get this into focus. If you notice... You see, that's my thumb. I'm holding the pipe. There's the clog right there. So you can see the other end is free. This has the hot water, and the clog is right there in the middle. So let's hit the thermal. Let's with temperature real quick. You see some hot water in here, 100, 101, uh, 111 degrees. And right in the middle, 82 degrees where it's clogged up. And then the other end is free. 
So perfect for home improvement. You would have found that clog just like that without having to call an expensive plumber and rip out all of the pipes or, you know, snaking it and all that. Nah, you can find the clog just like that. All right, so let me turn the lights on real quick. Let me pour out the water so I can, so I can show you what I did real quick. Just so you see, because a lot of people don't be believing this kind of stuff. Let me hit the next light. So all I did was, you see inside of here, stuck some clay inside of the pipe, and that's where the clog was, right in the middle. You was easily able to see it using the thermal camera. So fellas, let's recap. 250 bucks, so many uses for this, so many uses. Now I will be using it for home improvement and all that stuff too, but I'm mainly gonna be having a lot of fun with this. I'm gonna be taking this when I go out in the middle of the night, Fellas, you know when you're walking back to your car and you park somewhere and you got those possums and raccoons that be jumping out, you could do a quick scan, make sure there's no, no creepy crawlies, <laughs> make sure no, there's no unwanted visitors waiting for you right there, do a quick scan. All right, I'm just going to be, fellas, there's a lot of stuff, a lot of uses. Matter of fact, let me see something real quick. I'm going to stand up. Let me take a picture of the chair that I'm sitting on. I'm going to show you something real quick. Cause you know this also it also keeps your heat your heat signature. All right, so I took a quick picture of the chair that I'm sitting on. Let me let me find let me let me find the picture real quick. Here's the chair. You see that heat signature that I left in the chair? This is perfect to find out if people been sitting in your chair. Find out where, you, where your pet's been sleeping at. Cause my cat has a strange uh, habit of sleeping in my bed, and then when I come home, she'll run out and hide somewhere and pretend like she wasn't sleeping in the bed. So now you got the evidence. All right? You got a lot of a lot of fun fun uses for this camera. You, you can see I was I was locating the cat easily with this. Very easily. All right, so hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about the Seek Thermal. On a scale of 1 to 10, I'm giving this a certified win. All right, now don't just take my word for it. Go look online and look at the prices for thermal imaging cameras for yourself. And you're going to be shocked. So this one for 250 bucks, this is a certified win right here. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this. Let me know what kind of uses y'all would use this for. And um, <laughs> maybe I'll do a follow-up video. I'll take it outside and we'll have some more fun with it. Now, in New York City, it's almost it's almost impossible to find somewhere that's pitch black in New York City. But all y'all cats that live in other countries and other states, I know when I go visit my family in Atlanta, there's places that it's literally pitch black outside. If, there, if there's no moonlight, it's literally pitch black. You, you won't really find that in New York. Everything is lit up. So let me know if there's some places y'all want me to test this at. But you you pretty much seen for yourself. This definitely works. All right, so let me know what y'all think about this one. Shout out to everybody that rock with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google+. Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters I see I holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Voxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time. 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the Amazon Warrior on Sundays. Y'all already know. Stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys alive. Shout out to the Scissor Squad. Shout out to the Donut Boys. We're in the building. Oh, yeah. One more thing. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes and picture me rolling. It's your boy, Floss. I'm out. Deuces. Yeah, definitely get one of these for your ladies, too. Though. Trust me. All right. When you, go into, <laughs> when you get out the club and you're walking back to that parking lot, all she got to do is do a quick scan and you'll be able to see if there's any animals or human animals, <laughs> not, not, not just cats and dogs, you got human animals too. You wanna make sure there's no animals by your car. All right, so this is a win right here. Nice little, little, little carrying case. Put this on a string. You could even wear this around your neck when you go camping. All right, so this is tough right here. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces.